So you join me here today crossing the Dartford Bridge. How cool is this? I've never done this before. Um, we are heading to Eastbourne with the Decker. We're obviously queuing over the Dartford Bridge because that's what we do. Um, but yeah, look at the view. So I've just gone through battle. I wonder if they ever had a battle here. Um, don't really know where I'm going. I've got the sat nav on, but I've had arguments with the sat nav already because it's not taken me the way the farmer's taken me. So I've stuck to where the farmer's taken me because I said, oh, I've got a double decker. There's no low bridges, is there? He was like, no, no, you're all good. So that's why I'm following that. Even though that is done to my trailer height, still don't trust sat navs. Um, oh. So um, it says I'm, the only reason why I've got it on is because the way bridge closes at five. And it's telling me I'm getting there for half four. Um, so yeah. Oh God. Breathe in. Well um, this honestly, the road is terrible. All I can hear is the trailer racketing all the way down it. Um, but yeah, what's the time now? So in hindsight, it should be there in half an hour. I also do need a wee. I needed a wee 10 minutes, probably 15 minutes after I left the yard. It's been over three hours, but I thought I don't have time to stop. So um, yeah, we're just gonna keep going. This is new country for me. I've been over the Dartford, so yeah. Just keep driving, Bex. Just keep driving. Right, so I've weighed and now I have to reverse out. <laughs> oh, God. Right, so I've made it out, out of the way bridge. Um, I'm just going to keep going because no one's using their indicators, so we're just going to keep going around. Um, uh, yeah. So we've just weighed. And now I'm going back to the farm. I think it's this way. Yeah, we'll go this way. Um, that was quite, I was, I was very, very lost because I've never been into a scrapyard and then I had to reverse out. And I was like, you've got to be kidding me. But you know what, she did it in one and she was quite impressed with herself. So now we're heading to Windmill Hill and we're turning in there somewhere. I've already passed it, so I roughly know where I'm going. But um, he's, he's seen me, he drove past me. So that's, that's always handy, because someone knows Laurie. But he's told me to park, um, park, um, um, park opposite the church. <laughs> oh dear. I could do with a drink, I'm not gonna, I could do with a wee, I know that. So yes, now I've got my sat nav on. Because I don't know where, I'm just, ooh, that, where that car is. Because it's getting a bit darker, I can't actually see. So it's where this car, is it? Yes, where this car's gone. Oh. Oh. This way? I don't know, he's not the, oh, I don't fucking know. Oh, don't say that word, Bex. Might have had to go the other one, but I don't know this area. So what's your plan of action? in the middle of the road that's his plan of action yeah I don't know what your plan of action was that kid's taking a video of me I know they're oh he's turning that's all good I don't know where I'm going 
Oh, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going. You can't see me. So I found my lane. Um, it's up there. But the farmer told me to wait because he's just going to have to go up there to unload one. And then I can go up there when he comes back down. So I wonder how much room there is up there. I also really need a wee. So yeah, that's, that's, yeah, that's today. Uh, so we're not doing what I thought I was doing. Uh, he was loading up and then I'm carrying on. Following him. That. Um, I don't know where I'm going now. Oh dear. I know, when we go up his drive, we have to keep right and park in front of the house. House or houses? I don't know. He said we'll go up and down a dip. I don't know how big this up and down a dip is. Oh dear. Oh, I'm so glad this is a wide entrance. Oh my lord. I'm so glad this is a wide entrance. You should have just seen the lane I had to drive down. Got 10 minutes left of driving. <laughs> oh dear. Well, we've arrived. Right. Okay. Duh. <laughs> so, I've just got ready to bed. Uh, don't think I'm going to get a lot of sleep because the amount of mooing that is happening outside my door is quite a lot. Um, they invited me in for dinner and we had gammon. That was really good. Um, the Weybridge don't open till 8, so I get a lion. Uh, that's my microwave going off. And um, so I'm loading at 7. It is now 10.30 and um yeah i'm getting ready for bed so i've just got up i'm just sorting my stuff out I'm gonna brush my teeth i'm loading at seven it's now 6 40 um because the way bridge don't open until eight um the cattle kept me up quite a lot last night I'm not gonna lie I listened to rain in my ear with my airpods they are still going now um, other than that I had a really good night's sleep but I need to brush my teeth sort the face out not that I do anything to it I just put some moisturizer on it and that is me done. Open my curtains, start up, put my car down, walk around, check my lorry. Oh, wake up. Ugh. So we've started her up, put my card in. I've walked round. Um, Realised I rang over a motorway barrier last night. Um, oh, well. I did check my tyres, they're still all up. Um, I had a new tyre on it yesterday so I checked my wheel nuts on that they're still right, they're tight um, but yeah moves are still making a noise and what's the time? about five minutes you prepared? you're going on my lorry? hmm
is going grand. Um, hang on. As I was saying, uh, it's going really well at the moment. Anderson lead don't work. Uh, I've tried both leads. I don't know if um, they've done something to Laurie when they changed the ECU and fiddled about with the wire for the Anderson lead. But I cannot get any power to my trailer, which is really handy because um, I've got 49 to put on and I really need the top deck. And I can't get the top deck down. So yeah, go going well so far, yeah.
daylight when I'm coming down here. I came down here at night time and um, I didn't see where I was going. Um, but we've got 49 on. Um, I've got a 44668 and then a 33663. That's what we've got. But I'm finally glad we're leaving. That's what I'm finally glad at. I came down this lane last night and I thought, where is he taking me? And it was getting narrower and narrower and I turned down it and it was really narrow. In 200 yards, turn right onto Victoria Road. I will do that. I've only got my sat nav on just in case I forgot where I was going because um, I didn't know where I was going last night, sort of thing. Look, it's getting tighter. Turn right. Does I mean it's a good job I didn't meet anybody? normal bringing 49 cattle to a scrapyard <laughs> but um it's gonna go off now though exit i know where i am now right let's go and wait oh, i hope it's not busy i'd like to just get on the way bridge and get going because i've had an awful day oh he's going around there we'll see
much as I hate stopping, I decided I'm going to stop for 15 minutes because I'm not going to get there all in my four and a half hour driving. Because obviously, so yesterday it took me four hours, 20 minutes. That was empty. Because I'm loaded, I go slower. So I'm not going to make it. So I thought I'll stop for 15 and then all I have to do is stop for half an hour as far forward as I can possibly get. It's just becoming one of them days, you know, a bad one, like normal. I'm not going to lie, I've been having arguments with um, Satnav. Well, I, I don't know how to turn the voice off. Map settings. Nope. Um, she really, she's really annoying me and I don't know how to turn her off. So I'm not even listening to her, I'm following signs. It's just there, so, cause I'm looking at the time for, to message the farmer. But that's really annoying, really annoying. So I've managed to actually get back on the M25. Don't do the M25 very often. Um, don't particularly like it. I'm going for the Dartford Tunnel now. Let's get in the right lane to um, not hit the tunnel. Because that wouldn't be good. Hmm. Hmm. All right, come on, Bex. You can do this. So I've just picked my lanes. I I've picked my 16 6 foot bridge the tunnel yeah well, that's 15.9 so we're going for the 16.6 so this is a better idea really ah. follow the A282 um um good luck well the lights haven't come on so we're all good for that please bear next left you're a bit late. This is where we lose complete signal. Road. Shut up! I know where I'm going! I hate tunnels. Well, oh. there's loads of room. What am I even worried about? Going down the tunnel! Woo! <laughs> Look at this! Look, Laurie, we did it. Oh, I'm getting about the country now. This is when you need side pipe or exhaust, uh, stacks. T where's Tiny when you need it? driven through the Dartford Tunnel. I've been passenger through the Dartford Tunnel. You don't have to worry about when you're passenger. And we have made it through the tunnel. I actually paid for both trips um, on Sunday, so I don't need to worry about paying. I think it's, it's six pound for a lorry, just so people know, six pound for a lorry to go through over the bridge and under the tunnel. <laughs> ah, he's getting pulled. He's getting pulled. <laughs> no, my look, I'll get pulled. Oh, shut up! Continue to follow the A282. I'm following the M25. So I've turned Satnav off because I was fed up with arguing it, telling it to shut up because I could not be dealing with it talking to me. And I don't know how to turn the voice off. Um, but I am on the M11 now. Um, I feel really bad because I've got to get Liam to come and come and meet me where I'm dropping these cattle off because I can't actually get any power into my trailer uh, to lift the lift down. Now I can do it manually, don't get me wrong, um, 
but because the farm isn't too far away from home uh, he says he's going to come and meet me and plug the trailer in um, so I can obviously unload the top and then um, I'm going to get it home and see what's wrong with it I don't know what's wrong with it um, it was reading that it had power when the man came out to me down East Sussex um, but I said all I need is your power from your van and I don't care um, but yeah I might need a half an hour break I don't know yet because I've already had a 15 I'm gonna see what how long I've got left until when I'm coming up to Cambridge services whether to just nip in there for half an hour um, but yeah we'll see are you ready Wagos? are you ready we're nearly there, Wagus. Obviously, I can't let you top lot off yet, but I'm hoping by the time I have to spin around, Liam's going to be here. Here we go. Wagus, we have arrived. Look, I just want someone to open the gate please right I had to run down to turn to open the gate please. I don't run Ooh. I'm guessing since I'm doing what I'm normally doing I'll pull up and back round and then back back and then back there the plan of action is anyway
He's fixed it. He's a good egg. <laughs> and he's given me a spare. It was just the plug. Something so simple. But we are going to head home to wash out. So he'll head home to work. I will head home to wash out. So I've just backed on the wash. Um, I filled up with diesel. And um, yeah, I'm going to wash out. As it's getting dark, I won't be able to film because you won't be able to see anything. It's absolutely plastered in there. Liam's going to help me wash out for about half an hour and then he's off to work. Um, but yeah, don't forget to like, subscribe and I'll see you next time. I'm going to Scotland. <laughs>